Hi, I am going to make this for dinner tonight. It's going to go in the crock pot. And this is a meal that is so simple, yet it is so good. And I shared it with uh, my friend Marta, and she loved it also and thought maybe I should share it with you guys. So anyway, I thought I'd quickly tell, show you what's going on. All you need is a crock pot, and I have two pounds of flank steak. I just got this from, um, it's the Sutton and Dodge stuff from Target. Two flank steaks make about two pounds worth. A can of cream of mushroom soup, a can of tomato soup, and one um, little envelope thing of the Lipton um, onion soup mix. And I'll show you what I do. Hold on. Okay, first, I always spray the crock pot with some cooking spray, no stick stuff. It just makes everything clean up so much easier. And then in just any kind of a bowl, I mix the two soups together. I don't suppose you have to do this, but I just feel like if you mix it ahead of time, it makes it come together better. I don't know. And I do have to warn you, the sauce looks kind of pink and strange at first, but it doesn't when it's over with. Once it mixes with the meat and so forth, it looks just yummy, and it is very good. Okay, so just the two things of soup and the envelope of the onion soup mix stuff. And I just... Mix that all up together. As you do. Okay. Then I just carefully place my flank steaks in the corn pot. You could do this with just one pound of flank steak if you prefer. Um, it just makes, you just have more gravy that way. The sauce will turn into like a gravy and then you just end up with more. And then I just pour that on top. I do kind of wiggle it around a little bit like so that some of the sauce gets on top of the one that's on the bottom and all that but I don't know how necessary any of that is but that's what I do and so then I just put the lid on it on the crock pot the sauce there. lid on the crock pot I turn it on high and I walk away and go on with my day and then um, in five to six hours, it is completely ready. The meat is just fall off the bone. There's no bone. The meat is just fall apart. <laughs> and um, I serve it with potatoes and a vegetable. And it's great and it's easy. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you. And here's what it looks like right now, which does not look appetizing, I get that. But trust me, it turns into something yummy. I'll show you when it's done. Okay, it's been six hours, and here's what it looks like. It's made a lot of nice, yummy gravy, and the meat is just falling apart into lovely little shreds. Sorry, I'm watching the meat and the video at the same time. So this is, this is what it looks like. And there's another one down under here also. They just fall apart, and it's just yummy, and... It's just so good. So anyway, this is what it looks like.